Hello and welcome to another update video about Cardano. In this video, we're going to take a look at what the Cardano price is doing and also what Bitcoin is doing. Do only a very brief update because I just spent an hour in the uh, member live stream with the channel members. Um, but I, while we were doing the live stream, it was starting to pump. So I just wanted to update you, give you another update video quickly because Bitcoin, start with Bitcoin very briefly here on the four hour chart. We can see that Bitcoin has broken out of that triangle here. Um, it was that breakout formation that we communicated or that I communicated in a previous video, um, pumping, hitting the 49.2K level, which was over here, resistance and support level, so a very important one. Um, and we broke above that level. We already closed the hourly candle. And as you remember, probably that 48.8 was the key level for me to break out to say, right, we have concluded, co finished, that corrective phase here, down here on our way down, we are now back up into the um, into an uh, uptrend. But what is very important, what is very important, we need to, um, we're currently retesting that. So if we break back in, that's it, then it was a fake out, but it is a really good sign that we finally broke it. Looks like we are successfully retesting it at the moment, but probably for the next hour or so, there will be a lot of retesting here because it's a very important, resistance level, very important support level, you know, if we can flip it and that is key. If we really stay above that level, we finish the correction and I will just say, you know, I was wrong with my expectation that we will come down once more. Didn't happen. Fair enough. I am sure we'd rather have it that way, that we have some positive news um, and then I'm a bit con conservative side um, than the other way that, you know, you have someone always pumping and then we drop. So rather be on that side of things. And um, yeah, we're currently going below 48.8 again. So it's not over yet. It might've just been a fake out. So just be careful about that. What I just said, the guys in the live stream, we wanna see the four hour at least closing above that level until we're on the very safe side. And the day is nearly over. We wanna see the daily closing above that. So that hasn't happened yet. We're just dropping below 48.8 again. So yeah, there will be a bit of battling around this and um you know and, and in the end if we if, if we drop again maybe i wasn't wrong so we'll see but um you know always relax you know just take the emotions out relax watch it participate um there's nothing to worry about finances and emotions don't work very, very well together so just chill out and relax and watch the price and make your decisions um based on what the price is doing cardano still trading in this triangle here hasn't broken out try to break out you can see that here bounce back in um here on the four hour chart let's take a look at the hour chart just again but trading in this towards this apex of that triangle here as well and we are a little bit far away from that level that you know is comparable with bitcoin i'd say with cardano i actually want to see 265 broken but we are quite far away from that level now the 265 level that was the correction the a b c correction we came down the b that was the high here on the daily the close was 265 so i want us to close above that level um but i think it's not that important because if bitcoin at least closes above 48.8 and manages to get above it finally then cardano will follow either way because cardano follows bitcoin and i think at the moment cardano is following ethereum a little bit more on the ethereum chart that is a little bit behind bitcoin at the moment anyway so um, yeah, it's all looking good guys. Um, but yeah, it's just a crucial level that we need to get through for Bitcoin. So other than that, not much has happened since my last update video. So I won't make it very long. Just wanted to do a quick update because just did an hour stream with the members. And if you wanna join as a channel member, you can get that every Sunday. There will be a one hour stream um, or around an hour. I actually did a bit longer today because we had that breakout and uh, just join as a member and uh, at any member level bronze silver or gold you get the live stream plus if in the higher levels you get the live chat as well uh, in the telegram channel and um, on discord but um, yeah it's getting getting there 27 members now in the channel really nice community growing every day really fantastic thanks for all of your support as well um, and if you don't want to join that's fine as well it's up to you then you can continue to see all the videos that are published every day and they are quite a lot anyway to watch. So yeah, it's just crucial level here at the moment. I think Bitcoin is the more important one to watch at the moment, not Cardano, because Cardano will follow anyway. It's a bit slower than Bitcoin at the moment, I must say that, but it's normally lagging a little bit behind anyway. And if you remember what we did, just a final word here, what we did 
back here um, when we were down here, right? Um, I think I did a video when we were just climbing up here. That was very early days. Um, and Bitcoin was already, you know, did already pump, you know, was earlier and Ethereum as well. I did say I overlaid the Ethereum chart and the Cardano chart. And based on that, I said, you know, Cardano has so much to catch up. The catch up will come, guys. And it did happen then. Very briefly after that video that I did, we pumped. So it's just that bit of patience, that little bit of lagging behind. I know some other cryptos are performing really well at the moment, like Solana. But then don't get emotional about it. If you decided for Cardano because it's a great project, which it is in my opinion, no financial advice, then you just need a bit of patience and um, belief. And um, you can always invest in Solana as well if you want to. So um, diversify a little bit. But I think Cardano's time will come and um, it's never been looking that good for Cardano, you know, with smart contracts running, no issues since then, you know, it's all looking really good. I mean, with Solana, we had the, the, the failure of the um, of the blockchain, everything, you know, the whole net, the main net went down, things like that, even though Solana, I think, is still in the test phase as well, um, which is why it probably didn't affect the price too much. So again, that's just a brief update um, and I have to go back to the family now because I spent an hour on a Sunday evening now in the live stream. So hopefully you liked that update. If you did, please smash the like button, watch the 48.8 level for Bitcoin and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.